the inverse of matrix by row transformation row transformation matrix is 3 minus 10 2 minus 7 row transformation we have to take a into a inverse is equal to i that is a is take this 3 minus 10 2 minus 2 minus 7 into a inverse is equal to i is 1 0 0 1 now take row operations we have to take here 0 so 1 0 0 1 so 0 here we require therefore we have to take row operation r1 minus r2 ok r1 minus r2 change is at r1 so r1 minus r2 3 minus 2 1 now minus 10 minus minus 7 that means plus 7 that is minus 3 here is 2 here is minus 7 what are the changes at lhs we have to make changes at rhs r1 minus r2 1 minus 1 0 1 then 1 0 0 1 here we require 0 so r2 minus 2 r1 first row as it is r2 minus 2 r1 twice of this 2 2 minus 2 is 0 minus 7 twice of this is minus 6 minus 7 minus minus 6 which is minus 7 plus 6 finally it is minus 1 a inverse now we see r2 minus 2 r1 first row as it is this minus twice of this minus 2 this minus twice of this 3 minus 2 3 is there now we have to take minus 1 into r2 take minus 1 into r2 so right here that is 1 minus 3 minus 1 into r2 here is 0 minus 1 into multiply here by minus 1 so it is plus 1 now a inverse first row multiply here by minus 1 so 2 minus 3 next is we have to take r1 plus 3r2 price of this is 0 so 1 as it is price of this is 3 minus 3 plus 3 0 second row as it is a inverse second row as it is r1 plus 3r2 1 plus size of this say 1 1 minus 1 plus size of this minus 9 which is plus 10 minus 10 is there now this a is converted into i is a into a inverse. First step a into a inverse is equal to i and there 
A is converted to I in this way. 1, 0, 0, 1. So, product of this is A inverse and finally, this determinant 7 minus 10 to minus 3. A inverse equal to 7 minus 10 to minus 3. And this is the answer.